welcome welcome customer i'm thrilled to see a new face in my shop and here i was disappointed in modern wizardry that everyone nowadays wants just either a fancy magic wand or you know some energy cleansing stuff but i see a fellow dark arts enjoyer so I see it's your first time here. What are you looking for? I will be more than happy to assist you in making the right choice. Oh, you want a dark artifacts? Did you deal with dark artifacts previously? Mm -hmm. All right. Now we have a lot of cursed items, but uh, if this is your first time, maybe I'll give you a quick tour on the most recent technologies and things that are trending nowadays. Yeah, yeah, we don't do that anymore. We don't curse people with regular diseases or anything. This could work maybe a few centuries ago before humanity invented vaccines and uh, antibiotics and all that kind of stuff so yeah basically previously you just can you you could curse someone with the flu and the whole village will dive into chaos but it doesn't work anymore unfortunately but modern society requires modern disasters and i assure you today we have so much to offer to make the life of a modern human just impossibly hard. All right. Oh, I will show you everything and explain you how it works. Then you can make your choice and buy one or maybe a few. We have a discount for, uh, you know, bulk orders. Maybe you want to buy some for your friends. I mean, not like curse your friends, but artifacts. But how oh, many you can curse your friends too if you don't like them so much? So, who am I to judge? Let's begin. First of all, and most important, safety. We have our safety standards. We will be working with cursed objects filled with dark energy, so to protect from that energy we'll have to take the necessary measures so we won't get cursed ourselves yeah this happens sometimes but it'll be just a waste of time to dispel that curse later so yeah this is free on the house since it's your first time in my shop okay yeah, this will negate the effects of dark energy from the artifacts. We just call it dark energy drink. So, come on. Yeah, it's kind of hard to have this ominous long close and open can, but I don't complain. This is absolutely not made from the blood of rare magic animals. So, it has this nice forest berries smell. Really fresh and sweet. Hope you like it. Please have a sip. And maybe I'll have a sip myself. All right. Let's get to it. First, this is really eco-friendly artifact. The quill of absolute truth. Oh yes, this was developed as part of our eco-program to protect uh, some species of trolls that are on the verge of extinction. So, yes, look at this beauty. What this little one does is that it makes the cursed person think that their opinion is ultimate. And more so, 
this will urge these people to share their opinion and to stick it into everyone's face, especially online. This very specific piece was forged in the fires of Instagram comment section. Some say it's still burning. So it's a really rare gem, so to speak. What's most important? This beautiful cursed prism will render the cursed person absolutely blind to obvious trolls and this person will provide these trolls an endless amount of food at their own expense so this is a really good one if you want to send someone into infinite loop of online arguments with random strangers you know all right yeah this is a really good one to ruin someone's life because you know this person will just stick their opinion into everyone's face oh i know you already want to buy it but don't be in a hurry we have quite a lot of new interesting stuff all right what can i show you next if you have a person who's already not too happy with their life there is an amazing way to make their life even more painful and this can be done with the help of this little guy oh yes this is the crying lemon of toxic positivity it will force the cursed person to remain overly cheerful and positive even if they're literally dying inside mm -hmm. yeah this is really good for modern people as you know there are plenty of situations where people might want to stand for themselves maybe say no or something like that but with this little cursed baby with this cutie they will always have to say yes and be nice to everyone and worst case scenario for them but base case scenario for us these people will start to take all the motivational quotes and all this positivity bullshit seriously and they will try so hard to be people pleasers and look nice and smile to everyone even when the only thing they really want to do is to punch someone in the face so yeah if you know someone who's maybe concealing their displease with their lives or someone who's trying to fight their anger issues and be a better person this is a good way to mess up their head in every way possible so yeah this cute little baby will make these people look like this on the inside when on the outside they will be forced to smile okay and this is really evil thingy let's continue we still have more and for more chill and laid-back people who aren't trying to look positive or negative for those who really doesn't try too hard about anything i have this yeah the only restriction for this artifact is that the person doesn't have to be bald uh, yeah maybe if that person is bald you'll have to convince to put this scrunchie elsewhere other than their head yeah this is not just scrunch this is called the band of time elasticity 
it will send the cursed person into endless loop of procrastination. They will delay every important task and they will be constantly distracted and the closer will be their deadlines or maybe some important meetings or whatever they have to do the quicker the time will flow but the slower it will be perceived by them so these poor fools will think they have still plenty of time and then will end up just failing their task or maybe working or studying the very last night before the deadline and this is truly hilarious mm -hmm. it stretches the time itself so this is a really good thing if you want to ruin someone's project this is especially good for you know your co-workers maybe someone from your school or university mm -hmm. the most evil thing you can do with it it literally give this to someone as a gift before exams maybe so the sky is the limit just use your imagination and with this cute scrunchie you'll be able to ruin every creative project every important task anything really the next one is a living creature this is the worm of endless distractions it is especially good for creative people so each time they wanna finish their project or do something they will be constantly distracted by something by their phone notification by the sudden urge to take a photo of their pet maybe yeah not only for creative people this is good for anyone really and if the worm will stay with this person and the curse will develop this may even lead to a state where person won't be able to exist without constantly watching short videos or you know those fake videos with cleaning carpets or maybe when they'll have to do something important they won't be able to resist the urge to watch that video with 10 facts you didn't know about boiling potatoes so yeah this will create really a lot of chaos oops there's one spawn on your shoulder yeah they replicate really quick these little critters and no wonder this one you know streaming a service that i have the impression that it feeds them in some way so they are spawning here and then so uh, yeah it's not expensive actually but you can find it yourself it will just save you time and effort and if you put this into someone's pocket in no time there will be plenty around so yeah the worm of endless distractions and by endless i mean endless infinite because the amount of stuff online that is so interesting is really infinite and yeah it's really evil thing let's go on oh i will show you a few more excellent pieces and uh, let's see this is the dice of infinite episodes let me show you when you curse someone with this artifact and this person will make a mistake of deciding to watch their favorite 
maybe show, maybe some TV series, some anime, some something really. I don't know. Maybe they'll decide to rewatch all the Top Gear episodes. Each time they finish an episode, a dice will be rolled. And this person will only be able to go to sleep when there will be three dice rolling six simultaneously at the same time. Not like it's impossible, but the chances are not too high. And until then, this person will feel the need to watch as many episodes as possible in one seat, even if they will realize that tomorrow they'll have to wake up early to maybe do their job or to be somewhere or just feel normal. This won't happen. And these people will be powerless against the curse. They will just sit and watch episode after episode until they collapse. I was cursed with this thing once and let me say, I partially regret it. I watched 12 series of Supernatural in one go. Yeah, it was a good show though. So, let's just hope our little supernatural secrets will never be uncovered. Let's continue. This is not... Oh, oh I have plenty more evil things. Let's see. I have this really, really nice little mirror. And it is called the Mirror of Self-Doubt. When a person looks at this mirror, everyone will be looking beautiful and successful. And everyone's life will look just perfect except for the very own life and self-perception of the cursed person. Yeah, of course, in real life, still everyone will be just as chaotic and messy as all people are. But this mirror will apply a sort of filters so this will throw this person into infinite loop of self-doubt. They will ask themselves why aren't they such a good looking, even if they know that everyone in this reflection is just edited and went through some filters and maybe rented the luxurious apartment and a cool sport car or something like that. The power of envy will be out of their control. So, if you want someone to struggle with their identity and speed up their midlife crisis, this little mirror is a perfect tool for that. And you know what's the most fun part? If the curse will continue to grow inside this human's mind, the filter that beautifies everything will start to also apply to this person's reflection. And you may say, oh, it's a good thing, but no, in fact, it's not. Because this dissonance between their perfect and filtered reflection and their like real life appearance will mess up their head in every way possible oh it's it's a really trending disease i mean this is really popular cursed artifact many dark magicians actually buy it so you should try it if you know an insecure person you definitely should introduce this person to observing someone else's lives and someone else's beauty with all the 
filters and lies and staged decorations yeah it's a real bad girl so shall we proceed there's a few more artifacts i wanted to show you this one will be really good for adult uh, audience uh, i hope i won't get cursed all right this one is called the spectacles of overwork when someone will wear these stylish little glasses it will turn them into a you know productivity bot they will do their best to make and complete all the work in the world and neglect their own health their own relations with other humans their all you know mental health and if we are lucky and the curse will apply to this person in its full power the worst thing may happen and the cursed person will actually start to believe in this corporate nonsense that their company is their family that this shitty friday pizza evenings and you know this um crap tasting coffee that they have at office is a real benefit is a real treasure that is worth abandoning everything else to work for the company all right and of course when a person is wearing these little glasses they will be just unable to resist the urge to work on weekends especially if they are not paid for it and they will be absolutely powerless to resist if their boss will call them on their weekend on their day off asking them to show up and do extra work these little glasses will make them always say yes so yeah if you want someone to work themselves to death it's a really good way to do so and i was waiting to show you one last artifact this one is in fact the most powerful and yeah it's kind of overused nowadays because it's so easy to use it's like absolute win there's no way that it will not with any person really of course I am presenting you let me show you the tome of infinite information we have this in two sizes for convenience the big one and a little cheaper small one and uh, yeah we call this tablet and smartphone but this is uh, human terms in fact tom of infinite information will keep one's mind constantly busy making them literally have memory failures and forget about their chores forget about their health forget about their sleep forget about their real life friends all this person will do is to constantly seek information thinking that maybe this new popular science video will satisfy their craving for new info and they will go to sleep but it's not true the stream of info is endless so this person will only constantly check notifications 
and I will always check what's new from their favorite creators online. I gotta say, I'm guilty of this myself. I can watch ASMR videos like for hours instead of actual rest and sleep. But you can't deny the power of this. So, did any of these wonderful inventions caught your eye? Oh, yeah, yeah, this happens to all the people who come here for the first time. They want to buy everything. You must really hate someone if you want to unleash all this beauty on this person. Yeah, no problem. Take your time to choose. But be mindful of safety measures whichever artifact you choose you'll have to drink energy drink before operating with this object and touching them with your bare hands and just if so happen that you may accidentally get cursed this happens sometimes yes there is a secret solution it's really simple and will not take long but only the most advanced magicians know about it. You should listen closely. And this is a big secret. You should put away any cursed objects. This is important. Then you have to go outside. You'll have to place your hand like this. Yeah, just spread your palm with the fingers like that a little. No need to, you know, try to grab something. Just relax your hand. Place it horizontally. And lower this hand onto any vegetation that will grow on the ground near you. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and then you should, like, do this wave-like movements for maybe about a few minutes yeah you have to be in contact with this you know things of mother nature it have to be really any green plants and after some time the curse will be dispelled and you will be free of any consequences of this cursed artifacts and that's pretty much it Really elegant, don't you think? Just don't tell anyone. Alright. Yeah, if you're not sure what to buy, you can take your time to think. Like, my shop isn't going anywhere. So, I hope we'll see each other real soon. Until then, take care.